Welcome back to Anderson Acres, and we're doing a kitten update, which apparently also includes dogs and a chicken. So, kitten update. <laughs> There's a baby kitten. That's one of the girls. They are really moving around. So, there we have one of the little torties who's actually afraid of the camera. Little black boy. Yeah, you're scared of camera too. And we also have... A little black and white. Hi, sweetheart. And Dale. Dale's in the barn. Dale's our most friendly chicken, by the way. <laughs> and the other tortie. So all four kittens, plus a chicken and a mama cat, Gwen. Okay, that's everyone in here. They are doing fantastic. They are just shy of five weeks. Look at how beautiful he is. He's leaving. But two boys, two girls, they are doing fantastic. In another two weeks, they can start going to their homes. They still need their mom a little bit. And apparently they need a chicken. So, meow. Yeah, meow. Back here is meow. Back here is meow. So, they're properly adorable. There's also a wasp in here. There he left. Wasp left. Don't like wasps. Why are you making so much noise? Just because a kitten hissed at you? It's a kitten. Dale's also a scaredy chicken. Kitten hissed at her and she got freaked out. So, that's what we're doing here today. We are doing an update on kittens. So, Gwen's kittens are hunky-dory. They are fantastic. Doing really well. And we will zip over, go inside, and check on Princess Orange's kittens. So here we are with Princess Orange and her three remaining babies. Remember, she did have four, but one passed. So here she is with her three little ones. They're doing really, really well. You can <laughs> see how angry they get when she moves. But their eyes are open. They'll be three weeks old in just a couple of days. So they're doing excellent. They're having a great time. They're being great kittens. Meow. They're wonderful, wonderful kittens. We're very excited to have them here on the farm. And they have done very, very well. This one's my personal favorite. Hi, baby. Yeah, hi, baby. They're doing very, very well. Everyone is healthy and happy. These guys will not be going to their home for about another four weeks. So they still need their mama, obviously. Look at how little and vulnerable they are. Just because they have their eyes open does not mean they're done with mama. So they have about another month before they can head off to their new homes. And Princess Orange is a very good mama. Very good mama. Why she's in the house? She's a barn cat. Please don't ask. Anyway, <laughs> now we will head back outside for a little surprise. And finally, we are out here by the barn. I can't show you why. <laughs> and the reason for that is Moustache had her babies and she had them under the barn. That's fine. That's just fine. She felt safest underneath this barn that's where she wanted to be. It made her feel safe and protected. So that is where she had her children. She just had them four days ago. So they are far too young to crawl out. So we won't be able to see them. We did take a look. We can see where she had them. But we can't actually see the kittens. So they're in there. We know they're fine. She's going in there. She's feeding them. She's doing her thing. And that's all great. Here's whiskey. That's all great. We just can't actually show you the kittens themselves. We don't know how many she had or what colors they might be. But that's okay. We are all right not knowing. In the meantime, here's Tequila checking on our quail. She likes to make sure the quail are okay. And there's Whiskey just doing whatever Whiskey's doing. But uh, in the meantime, we have at least eight kittens. Four in the vinyl shed. 
three in the house and at least one under here. We're not exactly sure how many, but for sure there's one because sheep's going under there to feed him or her. There's probably more. Given that we've generally seen about four kittens uh, per litter this year, I'm guessing she had between two and four. So we probably have, oh, anywhere between eight and ten, I'm guessing, eight and ten to ten kittens in total on the property. And yes, they all do have homes already. They are all spoken for. In fact, I don't have as many kittens as I have people wanting kittens. But that's all the females I've got. So people are just going to have to live with only a few kittens. But all the kittens are doing well. They're all looking good, having a good day. Pony nose there is having a good day. Sorry, your name is Shadowfax. But that's about it for today. We'll see you tomorrow.